Settle down, everyone. Now, we all know why we're here. No. The invitation just said, meet me at really tall building on Coruscant, Sun Palpatine. Whatever. We've all been defeated by a hero of some sort. We're all going to team up to get revenge and conquer all our dimensions. First, we must know what we've done to them in the past. Team Star Wars. I know I tricked the whole galaxy into thinking I was a nice person just to form a galactic empire, but what did you all do? I not only wanted unlimited power, but I became obsessed with destroying Luke Skywalker. But when I became his father, he tempted me to rejoin the light side. He's grounded when I return. I tried to win the Clone War so I could become ruler of the galaxy. But thanks to Anakin Skywalker, I was decapitated. I was forced to be a droid general cyborg because of a plane crash on my home planet Kali. The Jedi helped my arch nemesis, the Huck, fight in a war on Kali. They caused my hideous appearance, and I have sworn that soon the Jedi will all die. But General Kenobi used my own gun to kill me. I became Central Commander of the Death Star and the main antagonist of A New Hope. My major plot was to use the power of the Death Star to destroy the rebel base planet and have the Empire rule permanently. But a split second before the super laser shot, a filthy rebel destroyed the Death Star. Once Windu killed my dad, I despised Jedi. A recording book of my father told me to become Jabba the Hutt's bounty hunter. He told me to bring him Han Solo for a large price, so I teamed up with Vader. After I gave him to Jabba, I got paid. And that very day, he threw me into the Sarlacc pit. So you died? No, I crawled out and was saved by Dengar. Since then, I... Uh, I have always been a villain. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I teamed up with this guy named Darth Sidious and planned to conquer Naboo. After I failed, yeah, yeah, you were humiliating courts, war revenge equipment on Adala, and hired Django to kill her, blah, 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 next team, Indiana Jones. I followed Indiana Jones on his missions and stole his findings. Me and my minions, Totten Dietrich, aided the Nazis in finding the Ark of the Covenant to absorb its power. But Jones knew that the Angel of Death would blow up my face, and he allowed it. I wanted the Sankara Stone. I had two, stole one from British people and had slave stick for the others. Using the Sankara Stone, we could rule the world. Then Jones stole them and pushed me off a bridge into a lake filled with alligators. Crocodiles. Like it matters. It does. Alligators are crocodilian. Crocodiles are shut up. Next. We teamed up with Nazis so we could steal the Holy Grail for its gift of immortality. I teamed up with Elsa so we could trick Jones into falling into our trap. Then Jones knew that the Grail I picked was fake and said nothing. I drank from it and suddenly aged to death. The last time I gave you the wrong grail on purpose. Lies! I used this crackpot to lead my Soviet friends to a crystal skull that would give me unlimited information the whole history of the Earth. But Jones left me to die while the crystal skeleton disintegrated me. Cool. Now team Harry Potter. Make that team mate, Harry Potter. Look, the Malfoys were on vacation Wormtail had a photo shoot at Snape was sick. Whatever, stay your plot. Voldemort hit on my head and tempted me to find the stone that would reform him and make him immortal. I tricked Potter into thinking Snape was behind it, but, st but still, with Voldemort's curse, Potter killed me. Yeah, I heard he just touched you when you died. Are you a ghost or are you a wimp? Don't mock me! Dude, my face has been electrocuted. I've seen Darth Vader's burnt body. Your face doesn't scare me. Ugh, no one thinks my face is scary since the seventh book. And now, Team Batman, I tried to prove to Gotham that someone as good as Harvey Dent could fall to evil. So I put Gotham in a scare in an attempt to corrupt Dent. Eventually, it worked, and Dent turned into Two-Face. But Batman took the blame for the deaths of the cops, Two-Face killed, and ruined my plans! I was abandoned by my parents because I was too ugly. So I planned to become mayor in Gotham. When I'm real life, I plotted to kill every baby in Gotham as revenge for my parents abandoning me. But Batman defeated me.
Hey, where's Mr. Freeze? Oh, he was put into Arkham's rubber room because he went insane about being one of the main villains in Joel Schumacher's Batman and Robin. Oh, we can't be true. Okay. Riddler? After Bruce Wayne rejected my device, I plan to use it to beam television into the minds of other people and to become a multi-millionaire. I used Two-Face to help me get the fun for it, and also plant revenge on Wayne. In the end, Batman foiled our plans when Two-Face fell down a ditch, and I was sent to Ark. Alright, that concludes today's meeting. <coughs> Still not scared. Dang it! <laughs>